Namaste beautiful yogis. Welcome to Ali Kamanova Yoga. I'm Ali and today we're doing a yoga class for back strength, back fat or bra fat that was requested by a couple people and I'm listening to the request and fulfilling them. So this is going to be fun. We're going to do a yoga sequence rather than a workout and we'll target the strength of our backs and also bringing circulation to the back and getting everything lean and elongated and before we begin i just want to say that back fat is cute so <laughs> accept it love it it's not a big deal but at the same time strength is also cute so we're gonna accept both are you ready to flow with strength and ease For this class we're going to use a prop and I could have brought dumbbells but I wanted to make it accessible to everyone so you can use fruit to beautiful Texas grapefruits they're about 280 grams each I measured them with my really precise baking scale sourdough scale so you can use those two apples would work or whatever else um, two bananas or four bananas or bottles with water those are 800 and about 816 grams so less than a kilo and we're gonna do exercises that are good with lighter weight you can bring uh, two pound uh, dumbbells if you have that but if you don't just books or things around the house will work great all right prepare your props and let's get started starting at the front of the mat roll the shoulders back and down Draw the belly in, pull Mula Bandha in because we want to work on that pelvic floor, retaining the energy, lifting up the energy, connecting the pelvic floor and the muscles and the organs, lifting everything, engaging everything, engaging the TVA, keeping the tone of the internal organs which leads to better digestion better metabolism better glandular health less fat deposits and so forth roll the shoulders back and down lift through the crown of the head a little tip i can give you about uh, belly fat and back fat is broccoli raw broccoli every day it carries the extra estrogen out of the body so in my experience it works really well quite healthy keep breathing breathing is another way to balance the metabolism and burn off extra fat that's not needed we all need some fat so fat is not bad just extra fat that we don't need inhale the hands over the head so now you're going to lift your toes off the floor and ground your feet into your mat press all four corners of each foot down and tuck the tailbone under so slightly extending the tailbone down engaging the belly think of it as a pelvic tilt so a slight tuck a slight tilt and we're gonna reach over to the right really lengthening here you will feel how this lengthens elongates tones the muscles alongside the torso and exactly those ones here are where the bra fat is bra fat seems like an offensive term i need something more loving like love handles is a nice term opposite side really planting the outer edge of the right foot and lifting over to the left lengthen feel that center going to the right press the left foot down look up lengthen back to center opposite side coming out release and we're going to do a few circles with the arms And 
reverse the circles and we'll do a few circles with the arms reaching out just with the fingertips so imagine you're drawing nice circles watermelon size circles this is the fruit class <laughs> watermelon size circles with the fingertips and reverse it personal watermelon that is reach over the head and we're going to bring the right hand back and around drop it down the left leg and reach over with the left arm up and over so we're stretching all of this area here and giving it a lot of nice beautiful new blood circulation blood flow inhale opposite side reach around stay elongated and tall lift and reach and twist inhale reach up exhale diving down in a halfway down forward bend bend the knees lengthen the torso here keep the knees either slightly or bent and we're gonna keep the left hand underneath the left shoulder and take the right arm up you're gonna bend your left knee a little more breathe reach ahead of you and press the right hip back and release opposite side breathe one of the best ways to have really good metabolism digestion and glandular glandular health is really becoming friends with your breath reach over the head turn the palm of the hand down press the left hip back and feel the length between the hip and fingertips exhale down and give me a very very mild forward bend here you can keep your knees slightly bent never hyperextend the knees or the elbows and you can sway back and forth here use your feet so coming onto the toes onto the heels toes heels softness smile let's bring the hands onto the hips straighten the back bend the knees and with a very straight back come all the way up bring the hands behind the head press the elbows back open the chest and lift here the visualization is heart to the ceiling elbows back lengthening and opening the upper back round the back and bring your elbows together inhale open this is very good for posture exhale rounding inhale open and exhale rounding and release open here and we're going to reach back with the hands keep them at a 45 degree angle so they're not all the way parallel to the floor they're midway and you're gonna open and flex the back 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 open open really flex I don't know if it's visible but really flexing the back great exhale down plank lower the knees on the ground and we're going to bring the wrist underneath the shoulders knee underneath knees underneath the hips and pull the belly in round the back look towards your tummy inhale open up lengthen the back lengthen the neck look up relax the face smile exhale lengthen and round think about the best way to call um, bra fat the best expression for it inhale open 
exhale rounding inhale open exhale as if the highest point in your spine here is trying to reach for the ceiling so push through that point and feel a lift as if there is a thread there and someone is lifting you up lift 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 inhale open you will feel a lot of beautiful circulation blood rushing to those areas where typically we're not exercising we're not bringing new blood there unless we get a massage or unless we do a yoga session and back to center let's take the right hand underneath the left shoulder turn the palm of the hand up and place the back of your shoulder down so now you we're stretching the back and the shoulder and the neck Inhale, coming up, opposite side. I do have a lot of pulling classes. I think some of them are here on YouTube and a lot of them are on my membership on my website. So I invite you to either join my membership if you haven't or to check out the free ones on here. A lot of pulling classes some with dip stations, some with bands, rowing and such, and some with dumbbells, and some with no equipment. But I do have a lot on back, back strength. I love back strength work. And all right, coming up here, we're gonna wag our tail and look at it. So look over to the right. Push the booty to the right, look over to the left, booty to the left, lengthen, right, left, right, left, right. Let feel the stretch, feel it. Right, left, right, left. Very good. So now we're gonna tuck our toes under and go into down dog. Draw the belly in, give me a mini stomach vacuum. Those are also amazing for increasing the metabolism and uh, removing excess fat. Fat that is not good for us because a lot of fat, some fat is good for us. We need to hold some fat in the body and we have to be at a certain fat percentage to be healthy. Especially women, pregnancy, breastfeeding, postmenopausal etc so we shouldn't aim to be really really thin but at the same time some fat is just a little extra estrogen a little sluggishness extra toxicity so with breathing we can balance that out some of it is from stress cortisol high so let's look over the under the right shoulder and under the left and soften the back of the head, relax the back of the head and the face muscles. Smile. Inhale the right leg up. Step the right foot between the hands and keep the left hand down. Take the right arm up, twist here. Love twists. They really work. And there's something that are, is not used in regular workout programs. Great. Bring both hands down and here you will grab your weights, whichever ones you want. Let's start with the lighter ones if you have to, otherwise take whatever. Straight back, come up, halfway up, again, about 45 degrees. And we're going to open the arms out. So this is called a V, V up and because we're forming a v with the arms so you're gonna open the arms out and instead of doing regular reps we're gonna do circle reps here which allows us to work with lighter weight effectively so do circles with your props 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, and flex the muscles. 20. That's already 30 because I wasn't counting. Good. And come up all the way to high lunge. Inhale the hands out and lower them down. Inhale, reach up and down, up and down, up and down, up over the head and reach over to the right, stretching that entire side of the body, the entire <laughs> bra fat area as well, toning, freshening the body, great. Exhale down, bring your foot down <laughs> and step it back, plank, chaturanga, either upward dog or cobra, lengthen, open, feel the back, widening and back to down dog exhale mini stomach vacuum inhale the left leg up step it through right hand on the floor take the left arm up twist bring the back heel straight up lengthen Reach over the head and feel that length. Great. Grab your foot. Pull the belly in and come halfway up. Straight back and give me a V up. V lift and a few more circles. About 40 to 50. So really focus on flexing your back muscles. This is working exactly on the area of concern. <laughs> flex, flex, flex. A lot of body awareness is needed when we do yoga and exercise and especially isometric squeezes. I'm gonna make sure to eat the grapefruits right after. <laughs> They're amazing. Texas citrus is really good. great come all the way up we're gonna reach out to the sides and lower down reach lower down reach lower down reach 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 and over the head and let's reach over to the left here you're lengthening both sides of the body try not to collapse the left try to lengthen the left and the right lengthen reach feel it Beautiful, let's bring the fruit down, plank. Chaturanga, up dog and down dog. Exhale. Inhale the right leg up. Step it through, high lunge. Take your more serious weights if you have to. So these are a little less than two pounds. And again, V-ups. This time we're gonna do reps. One, squeeze. Two, three. Lower down slowly. Four, lower down slowly. Five, slow. Six, squeeze. Seven, Eight, nine, ten. Step your back foot down in warrior one alignment. Lean forward again, and we're gonna do flies. One, squeeze. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't know about you, but my back is burning and we're gonna here do row with elbow extension. Row, elbow extension. Three, really squeeze. Five, six, seven. This is also the triceps. Also another offensive term is 
bat wings. So I don't know, we need cute terms for the body parts. And lower down, step it back, chaturanga, up dog, down dog, respectful. We need respectful terms for our body parts. Inhale the left leg up, step it through, high lunge, pull the belly in, straight back, grab your weight, halfway up, V ups, slowly down, two, three, four, slow it down even more, five, squeeze, six, squeeze, 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 squeeze. Seven, really focus on the slow down movement. Eight, nine, ten, very slow. Great, step it back, warrior one, and we're gonna open out. So really squeeze at the top, squeeze, lower down slowly. Three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and let's lift the elbows by the ribcage, extend. Try not to swing the elbows, try to steady the elbows and extend, lower down. Squeeze here, so squeeze the back as you lift the weight, extend, two, three, Focus on your form, four, squeezing the muscles, five, six, especially because we're using light weight, seven, eight, nine, and ten, and release it down, plank, to chaturanga, to up dog, to down dog. Take the right leg up, step it through, come up, high lunge, hands in prayer twist. Inhale, coming all the way up, hands clasping, reach over to the right, look up. Open the arms out, twist, drop the hands down the legs, look past your shoulder. And release down, lower down onto your belly. And here, no weights are required. Or if you have the orange grapefruit, apple, those are small grapefruits actually. You can grab them and we're going to lift the upper body and reach over the head and back, over the head and back, over the head and back. And when you have your elbows at 90 degree angle, you're going to really squeeze the back muscles. Let's do 10 more. One, two, three, four, five, hands underneath the shoulders, down dog. Take the left leg up, step it through. And high lunge, come up. Hands in prayer, twist and really keep the chest and back open and go a little deeper in this twist, soften the belly. Inhale, coming up, clasping the hands, reach over to the left, extending the tailbone down, look up. Release, open your arms out. Again, twist, drop the hands down the legs. Look past your shoulder here. Lengthen to the crown of the head. Inhale. 
inhale back to the floor plank lower down onto your belly really elongated cobra plant your feet down lengthen the tailbone roll the shoulders back and down Exhale, down dog. Inhale the right leg and open the knee. Exhale the right foot behind you. Wow thing, lift, lifting the hips. Feel the back awakening from the openness here. Toning. And reverse it. One legged down dog. Step it through. Pull the belly in. Halfway up. Grab your weights. And we're going to open out. Again, leaning forward. About 45 degrees again really squeezing the back slowing down the movement downwards normal speed up one two three four five six seven eight nine 10 and V ups. 1, 2, really love this one. As you can tell, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Drop the back heel down, warrior 1. And here you can reach over the head and lower down. Feel the back muscles working. One, two, three, four. You can bend the elbows. Five, slow it down. Six, seven, eight, nine. 10, straighten the lead knee, take warrior two and bring your arms out and we're gonna do circles here. One, whew, you're gonna have to wait for a second. This bottle is not cooperating, it's leaking a little bit. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Lower the right hand down and take side angle you can keep your top bottle it provides you with extra back work now grab both your bottles and come up hold warrior two just hold it this is all back work shoulder work reverse the warrior take the right arm up and good job release down plank to chaturanga to up dog to chaturanga to down dog take the left leg up open the knee lift drop it behind while thing widen the back lift open feel it And back to one legged down dog, step it through. Grab your weights, flies. One, lower down slowly. Two, belly in. Three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, ten reps, one squeeze, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. You can drop your back heel and do some circles here. Straighten the back, the front knee. Take warrior two. Open. You can take side plank. You can even reach over the head. Lots of work here. That's heavy work. Throw the back muscles. And coming back up. Hold it. <laughs> I feel it. Reverse it. And bring your balls together. It's okay, Sophie. Straighten the legs. Take plie. Open the arms out. Hold it. I have to turn it up. Reach over the head and down. Over the head and down. Over the head and down, over the head, and down, over the head, and down. Really squeeze, and turn to the front, take warrior two with the left leg leading, and we're gonna do a few more of those lifts. One, two, three, you can bend the elbows, four, five, Six, seven, eight, <laughs> nine, and ten. Step at the front this time. And we're gonna do a few more flies. One, squeeze and slowly lower down. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten. V ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Straight back. Nine, ten. Great. Lower down. Hold on to your weights. Keep them close, lay on your back, <sighs> grab one weight as a test and bring it over the head and back up. So see how that feels. If it's easy enough, you can grab two bottles or two dumbbells. Make sure that your body is able to sustain the move, the muscles and you're not using swinging and other coping mechanisms. Let's do 10 more of those. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. Bring your knees into the chest and twist to one side. Feel the blood rushing through your torso and 
feel the massage of the internal organs here. Send loving vibrations, thoughts to your body, to your back for supporting you, for giving you strength, a backbone. Opposite side. Think about the function of your back rather than the look of it. And be grateful for how functioning, well functioning it is and how much it has served you. I find it that the only fulfilling thought is appreciation for my body. That's always the thing that feels the best, that gives me energy, and it frees me from things that don't matter really. Because that's the most aligned thought that we can have is appreciation, gratitude, and love for how beautiful and functional our body is, how much it's serving us. You see young teenagers worrying about how their legs look or any body part, how it looks and rarely we're thought to think how well our legs serve us. All right, coming out. Let's bring, make sure there is nothing over your head. And lift into plow, stretching the back here. Legs over the head, shoulder stand, softening the throat. And release. You can rock up to sit it. And let's go for a side, side bend. Drop the sitting bones down. Level your arms so everything is in the same plane. Your shoulders, elbows, wrists are in the same plane aligning with your hips. If someone needs to take a slice and look at you from the side, everything is aligning in the same plane. The shoulders are back and down. And dropping the left sitting bone down, we're gonna reach up with the left arm up and over. At the same time, bend your right elbow and bring it in so that the shoulder and the elbow are aligning. The shoulder is open. If we don't bring it in, it will look something less elongated, something not as elongated. All right, opposite side. Drop the opposing sitting bone so it's holding onto, it's sitting firmly on the floor, which allows you to stretch everything, which is one of the great ways to remove extra hormonal or just sluggish metabolism fat. The stretches are beautiful. All right, twist side to side, opposite hand to knee, left hand, right knee. Look behind you and lengthen, elongate. Opposite side. Hands over the heart and let's bow to our hearts for their forgiveness, compassion, and love. And thank you all for joining me today for this class. Feel free to do your little meditation after the class, either in lotus, in easy, 
pose or even in Shavasana. Let me know. Make sure to let me know in the comments below how you like this type of class and make sure to share it with your friends and family. Share the channel with your friends and family because that's the best way to support the channel and to spread the message and to help out the channel so that I can continue bringing you free classes. For more classes that are really long, really detailed, advanced or all kinds of levels, beginner, come to my website alikamanova.com where I have hundreds of classes. They have never been shared on YouTube. They're all kinds of levels, all kinds of focus and it just and it keeps going. We're having schedules and programs. My will, uh, the month of May will be total body program, total bikini body. April was a booty program and those programs are indefinitely on there so you can do them whenever you want to but they're kind of fun to do them when we're, they're running for the first time so that we're all doing them together and then we can come back to them if we feel like it. Anyways, with that being said, thank you all for joining me today. I appreciate every and each one of you and I'll see you with our next class. Namaste. Mm -hmm.